In Kyoto, Japan, there is a temple called Sanju San Gendo that houses 1,000 life-size Buddhist statues and one very large Buddha figure in the center. Each statue has a unique face. The belief among the Japanese is that it is possible to find all the faces of their lost relatives among the sculptures. Inspired by this Japanese folklore, we look for new and better ways for people to find faces in a large parameterized face space. The idea is to provide users a spectrum of faces to select from, just like a color wheel is used to help select colors. In order to mix faces like mixing colors, we use an available commercial program called FaceGen to populate a large face space. We designed a color wheel-like navigation interface where the average face is in the center. By clicking on one of its neighboring faces, the entire wheel is updated. To undo, users can follow the gray line to go back to their previous step. We also designed two types of slider interfaces as other ways to navigate through a spectrum of faces. We conducted a face matching experiment to see which interface performs best and in which contexts. As a result, we have found that because sliders allow users to move multiple steps at a time, users approach the right neighborhood quicker. However, once in the neighborhood, the wheel interface seems to help users in refining. These results can aid designing face space in a growing number of emergent areas, such as witness identification, game character design, and interactive arts. It can also extend to the visualization of higher dimensions.